Hello. You like my wavy hair? Isn't it sexy? Nice and poofy. This is morning hair. It is 9.32 in the morning. And it's Wednesday. Just in case you need to know. I won't give you the weather update. Because I don't have any in front of me. So, I hope everybody's doing good. I hope everybody... That... that um, that lives in the United States is having a decent day because last night was the election. I don't know that everybody didn't vote for the same person. Sorry. But we have a new president and elect and it's not George Bush, so everybody should be happy. At least about the Um So I was in sticking last night with a bunch of crazy people. Yeah. And we had a good time. Do I need to go down the list? Okay, I'll go down the list. Let's see. Um, Art of Brown Eyed Girl, Diana. Silver Scream Girl, Beth. Lemonette, Lynette. Mumbai Doug, Doug. Sugar and Lance, Justin. Texas Red, Lane. Yo Yo Max. I don't, I don't know her name because I don't know her, but she was in there. Um, I think she's friends with Beth. Um, I've seen some of her comments and stuff on Beth's videos. Okay, Liz, Dizzy Lizzie, yeah. Beth, Lizzie, Stacy, Stacy, German seventy two fam. Uh, who else was in there? Who else was in there? These are all the people that were on video. I'm sure I'm forgetting somebody. There are some other people in there that are in chat and text, but I don't know. I don't know who. I think uh, Peggy was in there when I first went in there, but she left not too long after I got in there. Um, Mocha Doodle Freeze on. And I don't know who else is in there. I think I got everybody that was on video, though. Anyway, so we had a good time. Oh, Brandy was in there. We had a good time, and, um, we talked about the election, of course, but we also goofed around and joked around, and, um, oh, there was a guy in there named Dan, and I don't know him, but he was funny because he kept getting really shitty lag on, um, stick cam, so when people would say stuff in, like, the microphone, he wouldn't get it because... He would only hear like, I guess he would only hear like a piece of it and then he wouldn't know what we were talking about and he said, you know, he would say, what? What are y'all talking about? Or what happened? And the whole time everybody was like, catch up, Dan. The whole, the whole time we were in the room, they kept saying, catch up, Dan. Because it was like every, you know, every time somebody said something, he, he wouldn't get it. So it was funny. And I don't have cable or satellite or bunny rabbit ears or anything. So, I didn't get to see any of the election on TV, but I did, um, I did look at some stuff online while it was going on, and, um, everybody else was updating me, and I walked for TNT was in my room, too, I think, and, um, I think she was, I'm pretty sure she was, but anyways, and so everybody was, you know, talking about what was going on, and blah, 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 <gasps> A play by play of the election, and um, I watched the videos after I got off stick cam. I went and watched the video of McCain's video, this uh, video of congratulating Obama, and then I watched, and then I found Obama's video um, acceptance speech or whatever, and it was good. And, um, it was really good, really good. So we had a good time. That's enough about the election. And I was going to share a story with you guys from when I was a kid that has nothing to do with the election, but I think that I'm just going to save it for another time because it's kind of a long one to put on, you know, everything else I've been talking about. So did I say already I was doing a vid fee? I'm doing vid fee. I'm attempting to do vid fee best. Um, video every day forever, ever, ever, ever. 
And um, I don't know if I'm gonna, if I'm gonna succeed or not, but I'll try. I might be I might not be interesting, but I'll still try. Put my put my best foot forward, you know. Give me an A for effort. And um, and so and so um, yeah. So I got up early this morning. 7 o'clock, well, a little before 7, which may not be early to you guys, but mm, considering that I didn't go to bed until like 1.30 this morning, it was not um, pretty when I got up this morning. I'm one of those type of people that hates to get up in the um, morning, even though I've been doing it every day for four years, almost for four years. Um, I'm not a morning person at all. I've never been a morning person. I've always hated it. I'm an idol. I like to stay up late and sleep in. And that just isn't possible with my children. So, I can remember being a kid and hating taking a nap. Like, hating it. Like, fighting. You know, just not wanting to go to sleep. And, and now I'm going, the hell was wrong with me? Why did I do that? I you know, I just get so excited at the prospect of taking a nap these days. But anyways, I got up at 7 this morning with Cheyenne and she was not in a happy mood. She woke up mad and I don't know why she was mad, but she was mad. She was screaming and hollering and throwing tea and every time I went to put her down from holding her, she would pick her legs up and she went and set her feet down on the floor. It was pissing me off. And uh, finally, I got her calmed down and got her some peaches for breakfast, and she was happy. I did laundry this morning. I've been putting off folding clothes for like three days. So I had three loads of wash that I needed to fold. One that I needed to wash and put, and then put in the dryer, and then there was another one I needed to wash, and now it's in the dryer. And I got to go through Justin's suitcase that he had last week, because he's got two. And clean it out because I know he didn't because he said something to me before he left on Monday that he couldn't find something and that he was guessing that there were still clothes in his suitcase and I said well did you clean it out and he was like I don't remember I was like well they probably are I'll wash them while you're gone he took Noah's toothbrush whenever he went on his trip this time too which I thought was hilarious he said last night he said he got to his hotel um not last night but Monday night and or, well, Tuesday morning. He got to his hotel Tuesday morning after he did his job and said that he went to take a hot shower and got out of the shower and went to brush his teeth. And him and Noah have similar toothbrushes, except for Noah's is like half the size of Justin's. You know, Justin's is an adult normal toothbrush that's white with blue on it. I don't remember what kind, but anyways. And, and Noah's is about as tall and it's the same colors. Not exactly the same colors, but similar. So I don't know what Justin was thinking, but he grabbed Noah's toothbrush. And he had to brush his teeth with it because he didn't have, you know, another toothbrush. And I guess he didn't want to call down to the office and have them, you know, give him a toothbrush or whatever. So he used it. It's new. He's only used it like twice because he got it at the dentist. And he had a Spider-Man one that he didn't want to let go of. So he used Noah's toothbrush and he said it took him forever to brush his teeth. I thought was hilarious. Noah's got, you know, he's got, Noah's got more than one toothbrush. He has to buy a new, new toothbrush at least every other month. He wants a new one. And, um, and then they give him to him whenever he goes to the dentist. So he's always got toothbrush. But anyways. Okay, so this is my vid fee for the day. I'm going to go now. Bye.